Hey guys, today we're gonna review Ezio Auditore de la Fringe, the mentor from Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. This is made by NECA, so special thanks to them. Now let's get on with the actual review. This is his face, he looks old, and NECA captures that, it's pretty cool. This is his hood, he has some feathers like here, the hands and armor there, on the other hand he has more armor. In the back he has two scrolls, but that's the only scrolls you can visibly see. That's the back. There's his um like skirt thing for assassins. I don't know what they're called. Robes, yeah. Probably robes. There's his black feet. There's his leather boots. Now let's talk with the articulation. First you can rotate his head 360 can move it slightly up and down can swivel it side to side and that's about it with the head on the arms on both arms can move it forward that much backward that much can move it out this much and this ball joint can move it backward like that and forward like that for more assassin posing things can remove Rotate at the wrist, has a band there, single jointed. You can move this forward and backward, so like the choose is on a hinge, can rotate it. That same on the other hand. On the diaphragm, you can move it in right there and out that far, you can rotate it. The waist, the feet can go there, forward, and that backward, and you can rotate. The boots on the calves can move it down, can move it up. There's no rack up pivots, but it's okay because you have some toe articulation. Now we're done with the figure. Let's talk about accessories. Now, first of its accessories, it is sword. Forget what the sword its name is, but you can tell me in the comments below. Some pretty good details there. Some imprinting there, and you can store this on uh, a hole there on the belt, like so. Next is his crossbow, it's pretty cool. He has like a bird face there, some yellow on the top, some silver, some brown, and silver, like holding things. And the strings are pretty black. Next is the dagger. It's pretty cool. It's the dagger. And you can store this on the dagger holder here. Like so. It's pretty cool. And last but not the least is a left punching fist instead of the holding ones. So that's basically it for Ezio de Auditore, the mentor. And this figure is pretty cool. If you're an Assassin's Creed fan, definitely pick this up. And if you're not, it's still a great figure. And it will look great on yourself when you're posing it. So if you did like this review, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share. I will see you next time. Bye!